very fresh good morning my dear lovely students how are you all so kids once again welcome back to the virtual classes and i'm your science teacher ms zainab khan as you already know we are on chapter number 5 our nervous system so this is our last video of chapter 5 as we'll be completing our last topic of chapter number 5 understood and our today's topic is again very unique and different and it's uh, very normal also but uh, let's see how you can uh, grab an idea regarding this uh, topic okay so uh, but before anything kindly mention your name class and section in the comment box for your attendance and please like the video and hit the bell icon for latest notifications so kids our today's topic is really very interesting and unique you need to search it out yourself and let's get started these all are the hints for our today's topic any idea you can see various items over here some fruits you can see earphones you can also see you can also see a uh, rubik's cube slime fog perfume and a very beautiful painting now any idea please tell me painting you can see fog perfume you can smell cube and slime you can touch earphones you can uh, use it for any hearing purpose and fruits you can taste so now any idea yes today we are going to study about sense organs so sense organs is our today's topic and we will cover all the important information related to this okay and this is our last video of chapter number 5 our nervous system kids you know sense organs play an important role in a variety of functions and help in perceiving our surroundings these are an integral part of our bodies that enable us to sense the environment around us total we have five sense organs okay we can also call it as five primary sensory organs and these are ears eyes nose tongue and skin okay understood a network of nerves and sense organs is always associated with interpreting data in response to a special physical phenomena so this is the way that decides our interaction and response to the environment so kids i'll show you something really very interesting now in order to have a concept clarity for you all and uh, according to that you'll be able to identify what sense organs are all about and how they are helpful in our daily life So let's have a look at this. Sense organs. Certain organs in our body help us to sense the things in our environment. Through them we are able to see, smell, taste, etc. These organs are called sense organs the eyes the ears the nose the tongue and the skin are the sense organs in our body the eyes the eyes are the sense organs of sight there are two sockets in the skull that contain the eyeballs These sockets help to protect the eyes from injury. The round colored part of the eye is called the iris. The hole in the middle of the iris is called the pupil. Light enters the eye through the pupil and travels to the retina at the back of your eye a sensory nerve called the optic nerve joins the eye to the brain 
the various parts of the eye work together to produce a picture the eyelids and the eyelashes keep the eyes free from dirt and dust the ears ears are the organs of hearing the ear has three parts the outer ear the middle ear the inner ear the outer ear catches and sends sounds to the inner ear the middle ear helps you to keep your balance the nose the nose filters air as it passes into the respiratory system it also filters out dust particles we sneeze to throw out bigger dust particles or foreign bodies blow your nose regularly to keep nostrils clean remember to clean your nostrils when you have your bath the tongue the tongue helps you to eat and speak tiny bumps cover the surface of the tongue inside these bumps are the taste buds the taste buds help us to know how the food tastes sweet salty sour or bitter the skin our skin covers our whole body the skin helps to feel heat cold pain pressure and touch pores or tiny openings in the skin allow waste to come out of the body as sweat we should clean our skin with soap and water regularly so students you have to learn the concept of sense organs as your homework and you will write the names of all five sense organs in the comment box and uh, revise this concept very properly as it is very important part of this chapter till then stay healthy stay safe take care god bless you and keep learning